mama, can't you see? Mama, mama, can't you see? We're all trying to get free. We're all trying to get free. Mama, mama, can't you see? Mama, mama, can't you see? What they're trying to do to me? What they're trying to do to me? Mama, mama, can't you see? So what we decided to do with the Car Strait of Pennsylvania and our allies who supported us, what we want to do is to march from Philadelphia to Harrisburg to tell the governor and to tell the legislature that we're not going to take it anymore. We want them to start funding the things that make our communities safe, like schools, social services, and health care, and stop funding prisons. The Philadelphia Public School is now looking at a budget deficit where we're asking Governor Corbett to invest $120 million in the Philadelphia public schools. He's prepared to spend $400 million to spend, build two more prisons in Montgomery County 30 minutes from here. We're asking for 120, we're begging for 120. They're ready to spend 400 million to build two new prisons in Montgomery County. There's something wrong with that equation. And we know if you invest in kids on the front end, you don't have to worry about penalizing them on the back end, right? Stand up, fight back. 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 So decarcerate PA has a vision. And we have three main points to that, three basic parts. The first, no new prisons. We don't want a single new prison, new jail, new immigration detention center. Not one more bed added to our prison system because if you build it, they will fill it, right? Two, decarceration. The huge increase in the number of people who are incarcerated in this state and in this country is the result of choices that politicians and policymakers and law enforcement have made. We can change those laws, we can change those policies, so Decarcerate PA calls for policy changes that will reduce the number of people who are incarcerated. So there are fewer people going to prison in the first place and more people coming home and staying home when they get there. Third, Community reinvestment. We want to take the money that's currently going into the prison system and into prison construction and put that back in our communities. Put it in our schools. Put it to health care, to social services, to food security, to re-entry programs. Put it in things that will really keep us safe, not in new prisons. Having a, we're getting into Harrisburg June 2nd, and we're going to have a community discussion to learn more about how mass incarceration, the budget priorities, have affected the Harrisburg community. Okay. On Monday, June 3rd, we're going to have a huge rally at the Capitol at 12 noon. We want everybody to be there to tell the governor and the legislature we're no longer going to have the budget. Uh, well, we're there with our own message to talk about the prison system, the way that's impacting Philadelphia and the way that's impacting the state, but we're also going to listen to hear what the impacts budget cuts have had on rural communities um, and really to talk with people who are organizing across the state to try to build a movement against mass incarceration. Go, go. Incarceration. Go, go. 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 Go